Hello, I'm Brian Jeff, I'm a product manager with ARM, and I'm here to talk to you today about the Cortex-A53. The Cortex-A53 processor is the latest in a series of high-efficiency application processors from ARM. It is the most recent little CPU, capable of being used in an ARM Big Little processor. As with the first generation of Big Little technology, the Cortex-A53 is architecturally identical to the Cortex-A57, the latest big processor. The main difference being the Cortex-A53 is designed for a much tighter power budget, delivering today's full smartphone experience in less than 100 milliwatts, quadrupling the energy efficiency from where we are today. This is critical to prolonging battery life while handling the full range of workloads in the latest generation of tablets and high-end smartphones. The Cortex-A53 builds upon the already successful Cortex-A7 microarchitecture while maintaining 100% compatibility with it. The Cortex-A53 supports the ARMv8 instruction set architecture, which introduces 64-bit support. ARMv8 also brings other architectural enhancements like software cryptography extensions, more efficient register usage, and enhanced Neon SIMD capability. The Cortex-A53 will bring a new level of performance and power efficiency to high-end smartphones and tablets as a big little companion processor to Cortex-A57. In addition to its big little uses, the Cortex-A53 will also enable high performance at ultra-low power and cost points as a standalone mobile application processor. For applications beyond mobile, Cortex-A53 is equipped with reliability and scalability features to support many core topologies. These are attractive features for enterprise applications like base station infrastructure and ARM-based low-power servers, where a many-core approach with a mix of big and small CPUs can deliver maximum throughput under a package, power, and thermal envelope. The Cortex-A53 is the latest high-efficiency core from ARM that will increase the pace of innovation in mobile and in the enterprise. Thank you.